peeps, it's y'all and welcome back to my channel. Today I am chatting about stretch mark creams and some oils that I've been using on my belly as well as my thighs and buttocks. So yeah, these are products that have been currently working for me and I wanted to share it with you because in my last video, like two videos or three videos ago, I did talk about stretch mark creams that are not only working for, you know, preventing stretch marks but are also working for existing stretch marks where I'm seeing old stretch marks fade almost completely away which has been super super amazing and yeah I just wanted to share that with you today if you do enjoy this video you know what to do give it a massive thumbs up comment down below and let me know what other products you currently using on your stretch marks or the ones that you're trying to prevent <laughs> and lastly don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already Mwah. hey there <laughs> It's y'all's channel. So the first product I'm going to talk about is this Palmer's Tummy Butter. This is a stretch mark cream that is the consistency of like shea butter really. And it's been working absolutely amazing for me. Obviously it's cocoa butter based. Most of Palmer's products are cocoa butter based. Cocoa butter is perfect for um, stretch marks as a whole and as an organic product as an organic natural product it's been recommended over years and years and years that it's been it's worked excellently for many women so yeah that's the main ingredient in this it's also got um, vitamin E it's got argan oil soothing lavender oil almond oil it's also got collagen and allicin. I don't know what that is but yeah, it's just, it sounds like something stretchy, like something elastic. So it's got that and so far it's been working wonders for me. I've been using this since I was four months pregnant and now getting closer and closer to my due date, um, I've started adding more and more products to it just to make sure that I am, you know, making sure that there's nothing that's gonna come my way and shock me in terms of stretch marks on my tummy especially. I don't really mind stretch marks um, on my butt or on my thighs. I'm more worried about stretch marks on my actual tummy. I don't know, am I paranoid? That's just me. <laughs> So yeah, this tummy butter has worked excellently for me so far since I've been four months pregnant right up until now and I haven't seen any, any, um, you know, stretch marks on my tummy at all. I have seen, like I did mention in my previous video, some dark stretch marks on my butt. So I use this tummy butter at night and in the morning. In fact, all the products that I'll mention here I use in the morning and at night after showering and I've never had to touch up. I still feel the moisture when I come back home. I used to obviously do it from the time I was working so uh, that's how I tested the product from day one feeling the moisture on my tummy from when I get out of the house to when I get back which would be at 6 or 7 o'clock and that'd be just before I shower and then at night if I go to bed at 9 my tummy is still moisturized until I get up at 6 or 7 so that's really really good and that's always what I look for is it keeping my tummy moistured my thighs and my buttocks you know am I feeling the moisture am I making sure because I mean you don't know whether or not you'll get stretch marks but you just want to make sure that you are putting in place all the precautions that are necessary as much as possible as much as you humanly possibly get I don't know so to my butter I do use organic coconut oil it's got that you know that smell of coconut oil and it solidifies um, in consistency in room temperature so this is what I use I just rub it on my hands add the stretch mark cream to that and then as well I do use organic shea butter to this mix this is the just shea butter um, which is raw shea butter that I do use as well I make sure to add these products as an additional just to give it that extra moisture as well and because I know coconut oil and shea butter are absolutely great moisturizers naturally they well absorbed by my skin and if you're somebody who doesn't like coconut oil you can always just add olive oil to this mix if you do want to you know have your own concoction I do believe that this mix has been working wonders for me and if like I say you're not somebody for coconut oil Oil, an alternative would be extra virgin olive oil to that other seed oils if you want to be creative and if you are DIYer um, some people actually just stick to shea butter olive oil and organic cocoa butter so yeah go ham if you have to I don't think this is something that's you know a formula that's written and we all have to follow the same one I think you can be as creative as possible as long as you can track your progress and see that okay whatever I'm being I've been using is actually working wow I'm out of breath wow but yeah that's what I'm currently using on my stretch marks and I hope this video was really helpful to you and for you go ahead and tell me what you're currently using if you are pregnant down in the comments below give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and of course don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already Mwah.